Hey, what's Alejandro with Remax, and today I want to talk to you about what's happening with the market and whether is it a good time to buy now? Or should you wait till the new year to purchase your home? Now, for that, I'm going to be sharing my screen here with you. Now, these are the sales across the Toronto Real Estate Board from uh, September and year to date. I want to simplify the noise for you out there. The reason why prices either go up or down, it has to do with supply and demand. Basic economics. So how many homes are for sale and how many homes are actually selling? Now the rates cuts, the rates increases, basically that's fuel to the marketplace. When they increase the rates, the buyers wait for the rates to drop because now that home is more expensive they, and when the rates drop that fuels the buyers to go back into the market because now that home is more affordable so if i want to know how is the market right now i'm going to be looking at sales how many homes are actually selling across the gta and how quick are they selling now for that i normally look at two numbers I usually look at the active listings and I look at the sales. So what we do is we divide the active listings by the sales and that will give me something that we call month supply of inventory, which means how many months we have of supply of homes if no other homes come up for sale after today. Now let's look at, for example, the detached segment now these are sales across the real estate board it's very generic if you really want to look at your neighborhood you give you can give me a call i'll be happy to tell you what has been happening in your neighborhood so let's look at the detached segment we had eleven thousand two hundred forty-one active listings and 2354 sales so that will give us 4.77 month supply of inventory, which means that we have almost five months supply of homes on the detached segment if nothing else come up for sale. Now, to put it into perspective, whenever we have more than three months supply or four months plus, we are on the buyer's market. Why? Because that buyer for every home that's selling, he has five choices. Sellers don't have a lot of buyers, so they're a little bit more negotiable with the price. That's how we get the prices to go down a little bit. If we have less than three months supply, two and a half, one month supply, then we are going into a seller's market because the buyer doesn't have a lot of choices and they're gonna be most likely competing for that home, which it gets the, buy, the prices to go up. Make sense? Now we look at the semi-detached segment. We had 1,333 active listings and 446 sold. That will give us 2.98 months supply of inventory, so about three months supply. So as you see, the semi-detached segment is a little bit tighter. Now let's look at the condo townhouse. We had 1,870 active listings and 344 sales. That gives us 5.43 months supply of homes. For the condo apartment, we had 8,181 active listings and 1,312 sales. That gives us 6.84 month supply of inventory. What does that tell us about the market? So you're going to have a lot of opportunity if you, if you want to buy a condo because there is almost seven months supply homes. There's a lot of inventory condos out there. Condo sellers are more negotiable. There's a lot of people who do need to sell. They got divorced, they live in the country, they got a new job. Somebody passed away and they own a condo and they have to be sold. So there's many opportunities out there for buyers, mostly on condos, condo townhouses. Why? Because there's a lot more supply. Now, the semi-detached segment inventory is a little bit more restricted, so you might be competing maybe in some neighborhood. One thing that they, I have learned with the market changes is that buyers want to buy a freehold, 
they don't want to buy a condo and they go for obviously for what they can afford so they're going to go into that middle price range of a million dollars 900 that's kind of like the average price for the buyers right now so anyways if you're anyone you know wants to know a little bit more information what's happening in their neighborhood we can actually provide you the information and we can give you all the details alejandro with remax have a great day